I would say it's very much so not like crypto or the stock market, uh, maybe one day. But uh, the cool thing is that because it's not a regulated financial market, it is 24 seven, it is global. And so is wine. So when you're looking at the liquidity, especially as a lot of these wines get closer to their peak maturity period, so maybe could be 10 years, could be 20 years in the future, we start to see a lot more activity when they reach their drinking window. So for example, if you knew you wanted to hold this bottle of wine for 10 years, um, everyone else is probably having the same view as you, or they want to probably hold it for the first seven. And then once you get to eight, year eight, year nine, a lot of people are looking to buy and sell an offload. So we do see different liquidity windows where some wines start to really pick up in liquidity. They're traded multiple times a day. Other times they're not traded, you know, even, even for weeks at a time.